This drop knee Tayatoshi is a favourite technique of double world champion Wang Qi Chun. Jun demonstrates that it's normally done from a standard sleeve and lapel grip. It's important to break the opponent's balance just before throwing. By shaking the sleeve and lapel up and down, you force a reaction from your opponent. This is the moment to exploit. It's the speed of the rotation and the speed of the drop which really make the throw work. The drop knee Tayatoshi is about giving 100% commitment. Notice the sleeve hand and how Chun pulls it all the way around, even at the very end. You must be light on your feet and loose in your arms. When spinning in for the Tayatoshi, you should throw yourself as far back as possible. Then it's all about rotation and drive. So here is Wang showing it at the 2011 Baku Masters. Notice the shake from Wang to get the reaction, then the spin, and then the pull through with the arms at the end. Here's another great example from Wang in the same competition against Japan's Awano. Once again, there's the shake that gets the reaction, and Wang's in with the Tayatoshi. Just look at how he pulls through with the hands, whipping Awano onto his back for Ripon. This time it's 2015 World Bronze medalist An Chang Grim. An doesn't need to get the reaction as his opponent is already pushing forwards. He just uses his opponent's momentum to devastating effect. And finally, back to Wang, in the bronze medal contest of the 2010 World Championships against Russia's Isayev. This time, Wang does it from a cross grip on the lapel. As a result, he has to be much tighter to Isayev's body. Notice how Wang attacks Isayev's shoulder and drives through to finish.